Dolian with prettyconnected.com, which is a fashion, beauty, lifestyle website and brand. We have an accessories line. I also co-founded Share Your Beauty, which is a nonprofit that focuses on sustainably donating unused beauty products to women in need. We work with brands that are repackaging or just have excess products, magazines, editors, um, individuals who have unused products. And we partner with the Sports Act that donates their unused bags from past seasons and we make it as a gift. We fill the products and we drop them off at different women's shelters around the city. To date, we've donated over 120,000 beauty products since starting. Um, my instead of moment is I just try to be mindful. I city bike as much as possible. I get a lot of packages, so if I can save the bubble wrap or the paper crinkle paper that comes with a lot of packages that's brand new, I use them for my accessories line when I'm reshipping. I don't use garbage bags or buy garbage bags. I use bags uh, that I've gotten from events and different things and somehow they never run out. Uh, lastly, in my accessories line, we have these cute suck up straws. Um, they're reusable, they pop right out. They're silicone with stainless steel and I don't use straws and this is so portable it makes it kind of Hi, it's Bloody the Solar Kraus and this is Tina Michael and he's here representing the future because that's what this video is about. Learning from each other and doing better and protecting our future, ourselves, Mother Earth. And my instead of moment is my business caravan stylist studio where uh, brands can be a part of it and sample um, products and services to awesome content creators in real time. And the experience is edited and curated. And we ask the brands when they send us products to sample that they're not in huge boxes with tons of paper and styrofoam and bubble wrap and all that gunk. Um, when we do get that stuff, we try to figure out ways to recycle or reuse that. Uh, I urge those that aren't working with us but are sending lots of products out to sample and test uh, to think before you send, try to eliminate a lot of the waste, try to edit products that go out. We also love hand-me-downs, so we are always upcycling um, and trying to take care of the uh, great hand-me-downs we get so we can pass them along to the next little one. Also check out Lavari, which is my sustainable zero waste clothing collection, lavariclothing.com. Thanks, bye. My name is Antoinette Fingers and I'm the global creative director for Aveda. At Aveda, we care for the world we live in, from the products that we make to the ways in which we give back to society. At Aveda, we strive to set an example for environmental leadership and responsibility, not just in the world of beauty, but around the world. So every year during Earth Month, we have a network of over 50,000 stylists who would like to do their bit for the earth. So what we do, we do a fundraiser with trash and shows. And we make fashion out of trash. -in. And here's one of the examples. This is one of the dresses made for the trash and show, made out of trash bags. So instead of fashion, use your trash. -in. My name is John Salzinger and I'm a founder of Empowered. So what we do is we make micro solar powered products. And what they do is avert CO2 all over the world. 450,000 US tons of CO2 to date. And so we're really proud of those products. And we're also proud of the fact that we've impacted 3 million lives to date. That's also very exciting. The company is empowered. MPOWERD.com. Join our movement. All you have to do is buy a light. My instead of hack, I ride a bike home. Starting in July, I'll be using an empowered solar flashlight on the way home, bike light. And then when I get home, I'll read by an empowered Lucy Solar Lux. So I continually live to make this world better. And we do all we can at Empowered when we're in the office and out. Thank you. Hey everybody, this is Tony Trucks from the cast of SEAL team on CBS and corporate on Comedy Central. Since I'm on set a fair amount and sets are extremely wasteful, there's a lot of different things that I do to try to combat that environment. One company that I use is called To Go Wear, and they make this great metal tiffin box, like a metal lunch pail, that you can use instead of the paper plates they give you on set, or the styrofoam. They also make this wonderful wooden silverware that has its own carrying case. Another company I love is called Keep Cup. It comes in all different sizes, and they make glass to-go cups that are so nice. Of course, my water bottle and my favorite tea mug from Teamy. So these are just a few of the ways that I try to have a reusable mindset in a very wasteful world. I hope that that's helpful. 
Hi, I'm Rebecca Gregory, and I'm the Vice President of Education for Simply Organic Beauty. As a company, we feel that we have a responsibility to change salons for the better. Here at Simply Organic, we offer the cleanest, non-diverted, professional hair color brands in the industry and provide salon education on a wide range of topics from business strategies to health and wellness. Many hairdressers get sick due to toxins found in salon products. In fact, one in five stylists will eventually suffer an illness directly related to the occupation. So instead of using chemical-laden hair color, we carefully choose products rich in natural, organic ingredients and do not contain common toxins such as ammonia and formaldehyde. We believe you should never have to compromise health for beauty and are proud of the difference we make in the world. Hi, I'm Jonathan Proper, founder of Drops.com. Drops is the first liquid unit dose laundry pod developed in America and the only pod that's approved by the EPA for its safer ingredients. My instead moment was instead of all those plastic containers that are so much a part of household products, we would package drops in a compostable box and ship it directly to your door, thus cutting out the middlemen, the plastic, and the water that's so much a part of household products. Hey, I'm Alicia Reiner. I am an actress and activist and producer and one of the co-founders of Lavari, a sustainable fashion brand. And I have so many insteads, it's really hard to decide. But I think my newest is no plastic straws. How do I do that? I carry around a Lavari Simply Straws Collaboration straw. It has a lifetime warranty. It comes with its own brush and this super cute case that you can keep in your bag at all times. And I love it. It brings me so much joy. Check it out at lavariclothing.com. Hi, I'm Stephen Fan, founder of Comeback Daily. Comeback Daily is a new kind of business for a new kind of market. As more and more are turning to alternative wellness products and practices, we're here to join them on this journey. Instead of treating problems with prescription medical care and chemicals, I support my health through nature and a more modern method. Hi, I'm Annie Jackson. I'm the co-founder of Credo. And we are a clean beauty retailer. And we have eight stores across the nation and a website, obviously. What we are most proud of is we have the most comprehensive clean beauty standards in retail today. We have a restricted substance list where all of our brands that we work with who are conscientiously developing products have to comply with. But beyond that, we've operationalized our standards so that brands are creating products, working with manufacturers that follow good manufacturing processes, that consider the product's end of life, that consider ingredient sourcing, both from a safety and a sustainability standpoint, and also uh, categorize and clearly uh, identify for customers fragrance, whether it's a synthetic, which they have to follow uh, safety guidelines, or a natural fragrance. So it is groundbreaking and comprehensive and really will affect uh, human health and environmental health as well. So we're very proud of that. Our instead of hack is uh, most definitely TerraCycle. It's the most responsible way to recycle beauty products today and you can use it for home or for uh, or in a credo store. So thank you. Hey, I'm Joy Reese. I'm the Vice President of Skinny & Company. We began Skinny in 2013 to combat the 80,000 unregulated consumer chemicals that are in our environment today. We use glass jars um, instead of plastic because they are environmentally friendly and reusable. And we also use our coconut oil that acts as a preservative. It's a patented coconut oil that acts as a preservative so that we don't have to use any parabens or sulfates, petrochemicals or chemicals really of any kind um, in all of our products, which make them clean enough to eat. Hi, I'm Nicholas Rickemack, the CEO and founder of Flow, uh, alkaline water company. We are a sustainable water company uh, that puts high quality alkaline water with a pH of 8.1 in an eco-friendly Tetra Pak. I incepted the idea at Burning Man uh, to uh, disrupt the bottle, plastic bottle water industry. And we're sold all over the world uh, at Whole Foods, Sprouts, and other leading retailers like Amazon. Uh, my instead of moment is I used to throw all the recycling, plastic recycling in the bin without washing it. And now I wash it because the contamination of the recycling bins are mainly due to 
consumers not watching it. Hello, I'm Lynn Florio. And I'm Renee Tavalaris. We are co-founders of WellWithinBeauty.com, a digital platform where you can find plant-based solutions in beauty, nutrition, and lifestyle to help you become well within your skin, mind, and body. It's also the showcase for Planted in Beauty, our luxurious, efficacious skincare collection that's natural, organic, non-toxic. Good for you and good for the environment. Our ingredients are sustainably farmed without the use of harmful pesticides. Our packaging is recyclable. And with every purchase, our customers receive a reusable tote. Check us out at wellwithinbeauty.com. Thank you. Hey there, my name is Meredith Danberg Figarelli. I'm the director of Common Ground Compost. We are a zero waste consulting service based in New York City. Uh, we help businesses set up composting and recycling programs. We run zero waste events and we also run a bicycle powered compost pickup service called Reclaimed Organics. Instead of throwing food scraps uh, in the trash, uh, I put them in a compost bin so that they can be recycled, um, returned to the earth, and can help to improve the quality of our soils by adding biodiversity and other essentials. Hi, my name is Tabitha St. Bernard Jacobs and I am a fashion designer. I have a line called Tabby Just and also a zero waste line um, called Livari and I'm also a Women's March organizer. Um, in my instead of moments, um, instead of buying new clothes, I love to shop at my favorite consignment store, which is called Brooklyn Consignment. And it's where I get to shop really fashionable, cute stuff, but it's all secondhand. Hi guys, my name is Andrew Horn. I'm the founder and CEO of Tribute.co. Uh, we help people around the world to share their love and appreciation for the people they care about through these beautiful video montages that you see all over this page. Uh, on top of helping people to create these montages, we have give back programs so that we're donating them to hospitals so that cancer patients can uh, receive this type of support from their community when they're going through a difficult health journey. We work with uh, family members supporting people with dementia so that they can uh, remember all of the memories and people that make their life so full. Uh, and that's why we create tribute. It's just to connect people deeply with their community. And my instead of moment is rather than getting people more stuff, uh, I use technology, I use video to tell the people I care about why I love them. And what I have come to know is very, very true is simply taking a moment to tell people why you're grateful for them is the best, most meaningful gift you can give. So that's my incentive program. Hi, I'm Tanya Donahue, founder of Mango & Moose. We're a socially conscious fashion and lifestyle brand. We work with artisans in developing nations to curate and design life-changing collections that provide dignified jobs. And in Canada here and around the world, also a global marketplace for these goods to be sold. My instead moment is rather than shopping box store, I try to shop local or small family run businesses as much as possible. Happy day. Hi, my name is Mike Kraczynski and 20 years ago, I gave up the corporate world and founded a company called Wildlife Works. The idea behind Wildlife Works was that if we want wildlife in the future, we have to find a way to make it work for those local communities that live with wildlife in the developing world. We work in Kenya, we work in the Congo, in Colombia, in Cambodia, and after 20 years we've become the global leader in market-based conservation of large landscapes. My uh, give it up was meat. Uh, 20 years ago I gave up eating meat because if you were going to conserve land for wildlife, we need to use a lot less to feed ourselves. Hi, my name is Jessica Schreiber. I'm the founder of Fab Scrap. We're a textile recycling nonprofit in New York City, and we work with fashion companies and interior design companies to divert textile waste from landfill. And we've created a materials resource and fabric thrift store so that people can reuse fabric and upcycle. Uh, to date, we've saved over 200,000 pounds from landfill, and we've had over 2,000 volunteers come and help out. Uh, my instead of moment is whenever I can, whether it's shopping or eating out at restaurants, choosing some place that's local to my neighborhood instead of a big chain. Hi, I'm Mike Ndursky, former president of Bliss, CMO of Burst Bees, and overall good guy, and I'm gonna show you my instead of hacks. Well, you know the three R's of sustainability, reduce, reuse, and recycle, but it's the middle one, reuse, which is the most important, because you use the least amount of waste, least amount of energy. So my instead of hack is when it comes to buying things online. You know you get all these boxes, and all these packaging materials, 
whether they're styrofoam peanuts or whether they're bubble wrap, what do you do? Well, of course you reuse them, but you can't really reuse enough of them. So what I do, my secret little hack, is I store all my bubble wrap in one bag, all my peanuts in the other, make sure they're cleaned up. And I take them to my local FedEx or UPS office. They love getting them because they save money, you save space, and everyone saves the environment. So it's a triple win. And by the way, another set of hack is when you do buy from Amazon, as much as you want that soap dish right away, keep in your cart and keep everything in your cart until you actually need something. And when you need it, then have it shipped. It reduces your carbon footprint and of course cuts down on patching material. So that's my set of hack. Reuse, baby. Hi, my name is Stephanie Benedetto and I'm the CEO and co-founder of Queen of Raw. We are a blockchain enabled platform for businesses to buy and sell unused raw materials with each other, just like fabric, keeping it out of landfill and turning that pollution into profit. We've already saved over 700 million gallons of water and save businesses over $10 million. And by 2025, we can make that 4 billion gallons of water. My instead of moment is instead of just buying an article of clothing, I take a few seconds and take a look at the label. Just like the food we put into our body, knowing where this stuff came from and what it's made of is so important before it touches our skin all day long. Together, we can change the world. Hi, my name is Blake Lawrence. I'm a director at Cool Effect. Cool Effect's a Bay Area-based nonprofit dedicated to fighting climate change. We work with individuals, businesses, and universities alike to create a tangible impact on climate change by helping fund and support the best climate reduction projects around the world. I learned firsthand when I worked on it over a summer break down in Honduras building a fuel-efficient stove. It showed me firsthand how powerful projects can have an impact on climate change, but also on improving important aspects of people's lives, such as health. Now, my personal life, my instead of moment, is carpooling to work. Uh, before, I used to drive to work, and now, when possible, I carpool with my colleagues when I'm going to work, or I try and take public transportation. Go Cool Effect. Hi, my name is Amy McDowell, and I am the Chief Revenue Officer of Myro, a plant-powered refillable deodorant that's good for you and good for the environment. Myro deodorant has a patented reusable case and minimal refill packaging to save over 50% plastic waste versus typical drugstore options. We've launched less than three months ago and have generated a 16,000 person waitlist and have won Best Grooming Product Awards from both the design and beauty community. We're excited to make a difference with something as simple as upgrading your daily deodorant routine. My instead of hack is commuting by city bike, my local bike share, instead of using taxis or Ubers. Over the last two years, I've made 626 trips and have traveled over 500 miles across New York City. That's over 400 pounds of CO2 that I've saved. Plus, it's great exercise. I'm Dr. Terry Zickerman, founder and CEO of Love Somebody. I founded Love Somebody to create sunscreens that are safe for people and our planet. Love Somebody sunscreens contain no chemical active ingredients and are safe for coral reefs. Hi, how are you? This is Ariana from Ariana Oz, and we're a decorative object design studio based in New York City, and we try to create objects through a lens of wellness and joy to elevate your everyday experience and celebrate life's simple moments. We take a jewelry approach to design and aesthetic. We use healing crystals, wellness motifs. We make yoga decor, tabletop accessories, all items to gather you with your loved ones and experience rituals that are more important impactful and meaningful. My instead of moments um, are several. I always bring reusable bags when I know that I'm going grocery shopping so that I don't have to take extra plastic or paper bags. Um, I also pack my water bottle every day for work and a thermos with tea so that I don't have to use styrofoam or drink from any of that. Um, I try to be very conscious and hope to impact the world with our designs as well. Hi, I'm Kimberly Nair and I'm with Wardrobe. Wardrobe is a peer-to-peer -peer fashion rental application. One of our key goals is to slow fashion pollution. We do this by organizing individuals' closets and then monetizing on underutilized items by putting them back into the fashion cycle through circular fashion. This decreases fashion waste as well as excess. We only partner with green dry cleaners and utilize these dry cleaners as wardrobe hubs where renters and item owners drop off and pick up items 
reducing our carbon footprint and packaging waste. One of my instead moments, especially as a minimalist, is uh, renting instead of buying. The idea of buying something that I'm only going to wear a couple of times or become bored of or just for a season, for me, um, is nearly uh, stressful. So being able to rent and know that I can use it for the period that I only need it and that um, when I'm done with the rental it can be returned while it's still a novelty item and then as far as seasonal goes I uh, can just rent for when I need. Hi, I'm Sylvia Wiesenberg and I'm the founder of Dope Naturally, ingestible beauty and wellness brand as well as a fan brand that it's new to the beauty market. It's a bad beauty with body beauty and it's a sheet mask for your butt yes you heard me right even with my crazy accent it's a butt mask and instead of this year i'm going to make sure that our soil is fertile more fertile and produces a healthy food for all of us especially our children and I cook a lot, so instead of throwing away the scrapes of vegetables and fruits, because I'm vegetarian and almost vegan in 99% of my life, I am going to collect everything and twice, once or twice a week, I will go to the Union Square Market and donate everything uh, to the compost. So that's my resolution for 2019 but there are so many things we can do better and to make sure that we live in a cleaner environment and I can surf without plastic hitting me in my head. So to the best, cleanest and beautiful 2019. Mwah. Hi, my name is Ben Larkey. I founded a consulting firm, BAL Associates, and I've been a corporate responsibility and sustainability professional for 40 years. I'm also a musician and family caregiver. I'm particularly proud of the initiative that I've taken at almost every workplace to audit, identify, recommend, and implement initiatives that others either had not done or had not done effectively and need an improvement. In several cases, I had either been admonished or ignored, but my efforts resulted in improved programs, including winning my employer's 12 nationally recognized environmental awards which increased business value. In addition, at home, I've been driving a Prius and have integrated extensive waste reduction and recycling, energy efficiency, and water conservation into my family life. I'm Nicole Ruckelbarker Thomas, co owner of Intelligent Nutrients, a non toxic, next level, certified organic beauty product that works for you and the planet. We're third party certified and transparent because everything we put in and on our bodies must be nutritious and safe. My hashtag instead of, well, I'm, I'm a seeker of post-consumer recycled content. And toilet paper, paper towels, stationery, so on. Um, big, big fan of thanks, period, proof underwear. Uh, amazing, ethical, sustainable uh, company, best manufacturing practice practices I love it you know and um, I'm a mom at 51 and I'm at the end of the the life cycle of the period but I'm still using these in a lot of different ways so I'm just very thankful for things and um, for all the best practices they do happy 2019 hi this is Keshia I'm the co-founder of Camel Assembly uh, Camel Assembly is a global women's network and we believe in taking the passion and the vehemence of a protest or a march or a Twitter trend and translating that into everyday experiences, into daily efforts towards yourself and into the cause that you care about for your community. And what I do instead of, I, I try not to ever throw anything away and I try to support the people that are doing that as well. So Mulch Fest is a really good example. At Christmas time, Mulch Fest is organized in cities around New York and you can take your Christmas tree instead of just throwing it out on the curbside, you can take it there and they'll turn it into mulch and then they'll put it into other parks around the city. Instead of buying things new, I'll often go on Let Go, the app. And on Let Go, it connects you to other people in your area that might have the thing you're looking for, whether it's a record player, whether it's a bed frame. And the last thing I do is I use an app called Your Local, 
your local connects you to different restaurants that are in the area that you're in using geotags and you can go in there and get like a half price croissant or maybe a cheap sandwich or any food that they have left over that they're about to throw away instead of it getting translated into food waste it becomes a half price item for you to enjoy.